Welcome to the Empire Business Rampant, and welcome back to my Grimgore Ironhide campaign for Warhammer 3, where we are going to continue. We left off from last time in Immortal Empires, where we have now whooped the Cathayans practically into submission now at this point. They haven't really been able to do a whole lot to us, as we are slowly but surely pushing on into all of their lands, where we are getting very close to finishing this campaign up. I've already figured out which campaign we're going to be doing after this. I'm going to be doing a Cetra the Imperishable campaign, where... You guys want me to do complete world domination, and I have the intro and thumbnail ready for that. So as soon as we finish this campaign up, which basically I view it as we just need to complete the short victory conditions, which will immediately make us win our long victory conditions, and then once we do that, I just want to at least destroy the dwarven armies that spawn from this, and then I think we'll be done with this campaign. That's basically how I'm kind of viewing it. And for the most part, uh, basically how this is going to go with us taking out, or finishing our short convention conditions, once I take the Great Hall of Greasis, and then probably Han Port, those will be the two regions that, uh, once I take those, that will complete those conditions. So, we could actually avoid Han Port if we really wanted to, and I think I might, just to make sure that we, like, because I know that's going to have it so, uh, Karak Zorn, I think that will spawn a, uh, endgame scenario crisis army around there. And I would say we should kind of avoid that until we're ready and, like, we've taken all the stuff. Although, technically, like, Nangao is another one of the cities that's considered there, so that's a region I will be trying to take at some point. Right now, you guys don't have any more movement. I've already moved you. Uh, same with these guys, and I think these armies too. Yep. So you guys have all moved. I know we do have to move Grimgore, which at the moment, um, let's keep trying to bring uh, Skafag back down this way. Because basically, I'm trying to have you help us out down here. Um, and I'm going to be trying to get Rachnik's army again at some point. But yeah, just keep ra making your way down this way. Keep raiding. I would say Grimgore... They're kind of making their way towards the Fortress of Reg, so I'm going to start making my way over here. Let's do a... We can jump over. I'm only at, I'm already at full strength, so I think I'm going to just jump over. Although I'd want to kind of be in my own territory so I can get ambush chance, but that's not going to really happen. So let's just jump, like, right here. Jump right there. I'll bring all my heroes over here. And then I'm going to have it so that Grimgor, you're trying to delay them from pushing on into this area. Primarily Thorax armies. You're trying to do that. These forces over here. Uh, I'm already having it so that you are trying to take time to recover. As you have taken a lot of damage. So I'm going to hopefully be able to try and get some stuff around here for you guys. I'm trying to have it so that like we're going to upgrade this and be able to try and recruit basic stuff to give you guys a round tier. So you have something in those armies. Um, other than that, we're still trying to finish off Karak Azorn. You guys, I mean, sorry, Karak Azorn. Uh, you need to keep moving up with Oglok and Azhag. You guys have taken some damage. Zulfbar, I would say that for right now... Yeah, we can abandon that area and then keep making my way forward. So, make sure you guys are in raiding stance. Keep pushing forward. i to make sure that, like, you guys can get to the same spot. Um, you're in the city right now, so you get out of there. Raiding stance. Don't get too close to the city, so kind of go, like, right here. Right there. Right there. Keep slowly pushing your forces up. I can also then give you guys your scrap upgrades here. So get the weapon upgrades. And then let's now actually abandon Zulfbar here. Yep, I wasn't able to get to the forces of Rag just in time. So I'm going to let you guys take the auto-resolve here. Because Grimgore's right there. One of you has to still be in the city. Grimgore should be able to push on in there and retake that without too much concern, I think. Um, if that army is still in there, they should be. Yeah, so they sacked it, and they did take it, so it's the Dragon Slayer. Oh, and that's the army that ran. Okay. Uh, Thork Ironbrow is right there. His army is not nothing crazy. Let's see, you guys have a lot of armies over here now that I realize it. I'm going to actually pull back. Because what I'm going to do... Let's see, 46% chance. 56% uh, chance there. So let's go there. And then actually, what we'll do is uh, we're going to uh, we'll kind of just try and block this location. So this spot right here, we're going to just kind of make my way over and have it so Grimgore is going to chill here with an, uh, an ambush dance. It uh, looks like they wounded one of my heroes. Yeah, they wounded one of them. Damn it, that's not what I wanted. But I need to buy some time because there's four armies over here. And because I'm about to have my wall army go away, I think we need to pull back. So, we're going to have Grimgore wait here. Uh, I've got Skafag making his way on over. So, you can keep making... Oh, actually, I should have you take uh, Mount Greyhag back. I'll do that. I do know that 
I'm starting to get my heroes back over here so we can try and make Ratnik's army once again. We'll be holding off on that for right now. We don't have enough money for that just right now. Um, let's keep pushing on in with you guys around here. I can probably have you guys split up a little bit and kind of take a little bit more. So, like, I can have you go for this city, and then I can have my other guys. Um, let's see, is that army behind us? Yeah, sack and occupy it because we need more cash. So, right there, occupy that. I do not see those other armies. But yeah, let's have you then go for the Great Hall of Greasis. You can go right there. Sack that area pretty easily and occupy the... Well, actually, we barely had enough movement. So we would have to loot and occupy this area. But you can get set up here. Prepare those. Make sure you get the defenses built up around here. And then more growth. So you guys can do that. Uh, this army is kind of running away. It's got one turn on my thing, but at least my other guys are on their way here. So, like, you uh, can't get to this city right now. Keep pushing down south, though, so next turn you'll be able to hit it. Then I know you are now here. You have to wait for the Doom Divers to catch up with you, which they're almost here. Let's have you sit here in ambush stance. Just in case I'm able to ambush him, I'd love if I could. So you're going to be trying to do that. Grimgore is again going to be sitting back here. Um, Balthazar Gel, you guys are trying to chase us. They pulled away from their city here, which I appreciate. So let me have Oglock here. Let's have you push on in first to Grand Peak. Uh, medium casualties, let's bring the other army up too. And then we should minimize casualties here. Yeah, down to low. Take that. And then we want to... Oh yeah, 64k. Yes, please. So take that. We can go into the region. Occupy it, and then we will abandon it this turn. Uh, make sure you get out of the city. Keep raiding, and then I'll have Azhag keep falling. Uh, what building is here again? This one. Oh, uh, they give me leadership for goblin units. Oh, I want it, but we have to keep it. We have to just keep burning for right now. Because we have to keep making our way up. There's only two more regions for uh, Karakadron that they control right now. So they will finally be dead soon. Um, also looks like you guys are having a little bit of a resurgence. Are you? Who are you? You're at war with somebody. Okay, it looked like you guys were at war with the other dwarves for a second there, but no, you guys are allied with each other. I'm gonna have to push through you guys at some point. Uh, basically, once Azhag and Olgalok push through here, they'll be making their way down, and I'll be pushing you guys into this region to kind of uh, slowly but surely get rid of them. Uh, back over here now. So you guys are trying to recruit stuff, um, and I also have you just recruit basic goblins around here to give you a little bit more in this area while you're slowly recruiting. Um, to try and speed things up, I'm gonna have you get this. I will actually try and build this area up a little bit so you guys can slowly but surely try and recruit. There are regiments of renown I can probably grab, but I think I'll kind of hold off right now. Alrighty, I am going to be able to ambush these guys. I'm going to fight this myself because I want to see if we can minimize damage and not have it be medium casualties. Um, I know it's primarily because of the flying units and the artillery that they're su suggesting that. So if I can rush them quickly enough and do enough damage, maybe we won't have to care. And uh, it will be able to get away with the less damage. That's my hope. Simply because I know we're going to be moving into this area soon, so I want to try and minimize damage. We are in our own territory. So, even if we do take medium casualties, we'll still be able to try and have it so that we can get some good replenishment. We're still waiting on the Doom Divers anyways. So, we're going to rush on in here. Most of these units, so what we're going to do is just going to have us like, like half of you guys, half of you guys here. Guard mode off. And then we just want to try and have it, so we're going to run on up over this way, and run on up over this way, and we just want to try and surround them immediately. So just charge on in here, guys. Do what you can. Fully surround the artillery pieces and the um, skirmishers. I know that Sentinels and the Lions can do some good damage. Thankfully, they absolutely miss with that magic cast. And then we'll just have a horde of Black Orcs make their way on in here and start charging them. Yeah, I wish my lord was high enough level, because then he could actually, like, attack these guys with a flying mount. But, since he doesn't have a flying mount, we just have to go do what we can. And right now, at least, I can fully surround you guys over here. My lord, I have to be careful with you, as I want to make sure you don't die. So, we're going to have you specifically try and go back over... Let's have you try and help out against this line. That line's already kind of blobbed up and stuck in melee with other people. So, get on there. Start trying to focus these guys down. Since you guys have armor piercing, these units are taking quite a bit of damage, especially the lions. Okay, so the sentinels are almost down. This one's at about a fourth of its health. You're at about a half of your health. 
my wa or my garrison army is now making their way on in here. I know as soon as I get rid of everything on the ground, you're gonna you're gonna start uh, losing morale since you can't actually help out down here. I do hate that we're actually kind of getting around the same amount of casualties as I think that they are suggesting. Although we might get some decent replenishment like once we actually um, win the fight here, because right now this is doing well. Sentinels are down, and then I want to try and have it so that if we can, so once this is one is dead, uh, actually come over here and let's hide under these things. So we're trying to hide under you guys so you can't shoot us as easily. And we now just have to deal with Zhao Ming. So once he's dead, I'm just trying to see if we're under them, they'll be able to they won't be able to shoot us as much. And uh, they kind of are. Okay, just ignore that. Just start trying to rush at him and just focus him down. Okay, took long enough, but damn, that was actually pretty bad. Like, entity-wise, it's not bad. No, it's pure victory. Yeah, no, we should just take the other result. God damn it, that's fine. We're in our own territory. That's okay. Yeah, they these uh sky chucks forty six thousand damage. Yeah, that's the best battle they could have hoped for. That's fine. We at least got to just kind of showcase the horde of black orcs here. And now uh, what we're gonna be doing is we're just waiting for the doom divers, anyways. So we'll take our time here, kind of sit over that way and uh, try and uh, wait for them. Then we'll be able to have it so that what we can do is, once we have those guys reinforcing us, we'll start making our way into uh, Cathay now here properly. We'll start pushing on into them from uh, the west, uh, from their west. And then we can start trying to take the northern ter territories around there. And slowly but surely, like once I have all the stuff down south too, we'll be pushing full into Cathay. And let's see. So you guys have just the sky junk still alive. Uh, grab some replenishment there. Okay, I don't like that you guys brought troops up around here. I'd lose my biggins there, but that's it. That's fine. Because if I have it so that you guys just sit here, keep getting the replenishment, we just need to buy time in this area to be able to get me some more troops. Um, I'm just going to take this. I'm just going to take this. We can easily take that right there, because Grimgore, that's at least one army dead. This is why I just want to funnel them into that area. Keep trying to ambush those armies with Grimgore, because there's a lot of them. Because that's perfect. I, I do need to just keep an eye out for those agents every once in a while that have that trait. Uh, Grimgore actually now has an increased uh, ambush chance. I like that. Beautiful. So, you are doing better here. Yeah, you're doing well. Um, just have you keep ambushing this spot. They wounded my other one, too. They did! They wounded more of my guys. Stop wounding those heroes! I need those heroes, you assholes! And I can't get any more from around here. Fuckers. Okay, well... Oh, actually... Ooh. If Fag was closer, I'd have him make his way over there. First of all, I do, I do want you to reclaim that, Brayhag. First, reclaim this. So you can just, uh... Yeah, sack and occupy this. Sack and occupy that. And then you'll be making your way back down again next turn. But that's good for right there. So we did technically fail the wall. That's fine. Uh, I'm going to be able to get uh, back up there pretty easily due to the fact that, for the most part, I'm just going to keep pushing on in here with armies and armies and armies. Um, let's see, movement range. You can get to about here. Let's then start pushing forward with you guys. I would lose some of my black orcs, so I'll just withdraw them for right now. Just hold off, get that extra replenishment, and then um, we can just have you an ambush dance again here. Next turn, then I'll have you guys push forward out of here. So, besides that, then, uh, we want to now have it, so we're going to hit Maw Gate here. So, let's hit Maw Gate, attack this area, sack it, and then occupy it. We'll be having you guys so at the moment right now. Let's see. So, this stuff I want to ignore. I want to really focus primarily on these regions over here. Because uh, you guys will be the ones that will primarily be pressuring them in Cathay's proper. So, let's keep making our way forward. And then we just want to keep upgrading Maw Gate. So, upgrade that. Get defenses. Get growth. Upgrade the growth. And then you guys here. So, at the moment... um. You can't get where I want you to go to right now, so let's just have you kind of go right here for right now. And then next turn, unless you have enough with... Uh, ooh, actually... I think you barely do. Yeah, because if you go there... You go there... Yeah! There we go. So we can hit Grimtop right here now. Push on in there. 
And then, uh, this one you definitely have enough movement to sack. And then occupy the region. So let's go on in here. Occupy Grimtop. Uh, next turn, I'll have you guys go to the west. You guys will go towards, uh, Shambletown. And slowly but surely, we are making some really good progress down around here. Uh, back over here now. We gotta push through Froth. A lot of armies are chasing us here. That's okay. And the fighting, yeah, I love with how many we're already, we're already almost about to get another wall already here. I'll see if we can get one this turn too. I'd love if we could. Uh, you don't lose anything, so just take the other result. That way we can focus most of the damage on just one army. Get the replenishment, and I'll have it so that what we'll do is we can get, so we have to get up to, let's see, how far can you get? You can get a little bit further up. So I'll have it so that you are going to be in front, and then you be in back, so that the stronger army that has more troops will be kind of defending the rear. You can try and do that. 66 from just with this one turn alone. If we could fight a couple more battles this turn, but we can't. We could actually have it so that we could get more. Also, you guys did have to interrupt your recruitment, sadly. Um, this guy is still recruiting. I'll have you now start getting some uh, orc boys. And then I'm going to focus on getting you stuff first. So we'll try and focus on getting you some stuff. This army here, I'm just, I'm now going to grab all of this. Just to have you guys have something around here for right now. To try and hold out a little bit longer around here. On that, Grimgore, you just need to keep staying around here. Yeah, just keep trying to ambush. If there's a better spot to do an ambush, I would take it. But for right now, I think that's the best spot to just kind of chill here. And see if we can keep ambushing these armies as they're making their way forward. Because I technically could rush forward. No, I will not shame my I'd rather man. not, though. I'd rather. Well, actually, I think I should get closer to Black Fortress. Because if I go... They're going to make their way up this way anyways. Ambush chances, are they any better around here? I can go here. Gets me a little bit closer, so that way they might not bring both of their armies. Because, like, this guy can barely get here. Ah, oh, you gonna ask for another piece? You gonna offer me more? Nope. You got Offer me 100k? I might consider it. But I'm probably just gonna keep trying to kill you, because at this point in time right now, this is giving me a golden opportunity to just push all the way to the east and take literally everything over there. So, I'm not stopping. You can go fuck yourself. Thorpe and Brown and everybody else is, yeah, still pushing up here. At least we almost have Skafag back over here. So, once he's here, we can make sure we kind of minimize damage. Although, honestly, I'm probably going to be able to start a wall this turn. Probably going to have it, so we're just going to keep setting it uh, on our sights on Cathay for that. So, for you guys here, you've now been able to get a pretty good amount of replenishment. I'd say now we can try and have you guys attack this. So, let's get you a little bit closer. Right there. Right there. They're not going to run. Ah, oh, I'd lose some of my black orcs. No. No, I, I'm, I'm fighting this myself. I'm not losing my black orcs for this. Because what we're going to do... The, honestly, it's the other army doing all the work. Seriously. The other army will be doing most of the work. Um, so we're going to wait for them to get on the map. They're going to unload on everybody that they possibly can. And we just need to defend them. As long as we give them the infantry support they need, these guys are not getting through here. The, no. No. And I'm, I, I just need to prevent, like, what, we it was saying we'd lose, like, two or three of my Black Orcs. No, we shouldn't. We shouldn't lose any of my Black Orcs for this, especially given the fact that we have so many fucking Doom Divers. Game, do you not realize how many fucking Doom Divers I have in this army? So let's have you guys, yeah, just back up. We want to be closer to our allies. Wait for them. So let's back up here. We want to be back here. They can't even shoot us right now, so we just need a minute and a half, almost two, for them. So, hello, random test subjects, who get to see what all these Doom Divers can do! Like, you're gonna walk towards me, your cab is going to get fucking slaughtered, absolutely, as they try and make their way forward here. Infantry, I'll start pushing you guys forward in a bit, probably, here, but for right now, nah, we don't need to. We don't need to really move all that much. Uh, why are you guys moving? I actually, I try to not give you orders. Um, so yeah, back off. Just have it so that for right now, wow, that one unit is slaughtered. Um, their artillery pieces are starting to fire on me, so we're gonna start trying to make our way forward. I need to start having my Doom Divers start moving up a little bit as well. So keep making your way forward, but just look at this! <laughs> Instantly just destroy this fucking chain line. It's already almost dead. 
Oh, uh, you're taking some damage, so pull back. Again, we're trying to make sure we don't lose specific units, so you can pull back right there. Just keep slowly bringing my Doom Divers closer. Okay, so now their lords are getting in range. Um, what's gonna happen here with all the Doom Divers? Because you guys are making your way towards me. But, uh, please unload into said Doom Divers. Yeah, well, Doom Divers into them. Come on, guys. I need you to fire on the lords. Are you gonna fire? Ah, oh, there you go. Just trying to fly through the sky to try and hit lords is kind of interesting. It's kind of working. Kind of not working at the same time. As you guys are... Hey, you're pelting them. Oh, you know, there we go. Much better. Much better damage on these guys. So, at the moment, I'm trying to get you guys kind of behind the trees. So that you guys can uh, take damage, or absorb damage into the trees for the artillery pieces. So you guys do that. I'm going to have the lords back here to save my doom divers so you guys pull back try and get over here did you seriously put one spell on this poor bastard why okay so we got their lord off of my doom divers uh now i'm having so my doom divers try and take out the sky junks here so you focus on those infantry you're doing pretty well down here in the melee blob here because i i knew you guys would win that it's just their sky junks and artillery that are the biggest issue so you guys keep doing that i think one of my guys did run off the map but that's fine he'll survive so all of you guys, yeah, just keep focusing down the sky junks. As soon as those are dead, then it's just the rest of this army. Like, we just need to get rid of their artillery pieces as well. And then we've won. Sky junks are trying really hard to take out my dudes. But, hey, there we go. So we had all my Doom Divers again. I think everybody should be alive. I'm going to try and make sure I see if I can at least take out this one of the sky junk. Now you guys have to keep moving. That's fine. So there we go. I should have been able to keep everybody alive. That was the whole point of that fight. You know, all my infantry's alive. Doom Divers, they took a little bit of damage. I think most of them kept all of their stuff, so we should be okay. But we'll keep pushing forward with you guys into the northern sections of Cathay. That's going to be your guys' goal. And then, I think because of this fight, or probably maybe the next fight or the fight after I do with that, I'm starting another WA this turn. I, I do love, literally, it just needs... If I get enough battles in a turn, I can start a WA every single time now. I kind of wish you didn't have to wait for the time to end. And it's like, oh, as soon as you took the area, you completed your WA. Like, I'd appreciate that. But then again, that could snowball really hard with orcs. So I can understand why there has to be a delay between ending a WA and starting a WA. Because, let's see, so... Yeah, no, I kept everybody alive. Uh, I'll get you some replenishment. And then that's going to push you guys back a little bit. That'll give me a little bit of... Let's see, so from fighting battles... Yep, there we go. I can start a wall now. So we can start a wall. I'll wait just one second. I want to have it so what we're going to do here is I want to have it so we finish off this army first. And see if I can hit that other one too. Then we'll start the wall. So you can hit these guys. Uh, hold off. Because it said lose guys. Oh. Uh, if that's the case, then we'll hold off. Raid this area. Raid this area. And then I just... The yeah, just stay where you are. So, let's start the wall again. And then... I know they're not as high pow ranking this time now. But I, I'm still going to just have it to be selected on Cathay. So, we're going to keep selecting Cathay for right now. Keep doing uh, Gork. Hey, we got some Waz starting up. Oh, uh, man. Actually, I should have done the other actions with you guys first here. But that's fine. So, again. Uh, these armies here. I, what I want you guys to do is start making your way over here to Flayed Rock. So you're going to go over this way. Same with you. So you'll go there. These guys will be the ones that make their way down here to try and go for uh, Shambletown. So you'll go there. Grimgore, I'm still going to have you just keep amb uh, trying to ambush around here. Although, is there a better spot to go and just be next to the city? I'm just going to go here because if I get the garrison, that'd be the perfect way to go about this. Uh, you already have the defenses there. Get this that and then we just need to have a soska fag you need to keep making your way back here i might actually have you push down this way no i should have you kind of make your way over here so you'll kind of keep making your way over to the east oh, can these guys go yeah they can't get to you for right now so keep making your way over this way then back here now i can have you guys hit the fallen king mountain um i'll try to bring both you guys on this way again barely any damage this one, I think... Oh, I want that money, though. Yeah, no, sack it. 
I was going to say I could just raise this one and then just back off because we need to go back down south anyways. But no. Occupy the region. Get out of there. And then uh, go back into raiding stance. And then you will abandon this region. And then I'll just have Azhag again. Azhag is just defending the flank for right now. So you'll do that. I don't like how you guys are just chasing me. It seems so unrealistic that you guys... Look at this. Four fucking armies just randomly chasing me out this way. Like, why? Why are you chasing me through the mountains? Ah, it's so stupid sometimes. But that's okay. Um, you, again, you're good for right now. This is the army that we're primarily focusing on trying to get all their black orcs back in here. So keep doing that. As soon as I get a full stack army with either the, the orc boys and the black orcs, um, then I'll start switching over to try and give you more of your doom divers again for this army. Ungrim, you son of a bitch. I was almost done with you guys. You're going to take it, aren't you? Yep. Uh, nope, don't understand that. I did get another ambush here, though. Hello! Good job. Take them out. Uh, let's just grab the replenishment there. So, Karakadra now has one more city. That's fine. I'm going to be making my way back there right now at this point to start trying to... Because they, there's the one more city they have in the mountains. So he's only in one area. Again, get more get more weapons. Right. We have so many more melee units. God damn it, Ungrim, you son of a bitch. That's fine. Let's see, we just need to get down here. Again, why are you chasing me, you fucks? <laughs> okay, keep making my way down this way. So, make my way down here. Keep raiding. So we just have to hit Mount Gunbad, and then we'll make my way over here. Um, I don't have any extra troops right now, so we're going to have to hold off on that. Uh, does look like, though, so with me taking that one army out, uh, they don't have a whole lot around here now, so I'm going to make my way back out here. Let's see, so I go here again. And then just stay in ambush stance while we're making my way over to this army. And I'll start pushing forward. Uh, Skafag, I want you to go over to the Sentinels. Although, actually, I could have you... I'll have you... I'll go boom, boom, and then you can kind of go up towards uh, Ungrim. You can try and do that, I would say. Back over here. You guys don't have enough movement to get to Flayed Rock. We'll be able to at least start raiding the area, though. You guys, next turn, will be able to get to Shambletown. But you can almost start raiding this region. Back up here now. So they're pulling back. They're taking a lot of damage. And then I've got my Waz going on around here. Let's see. So I would say... As soon as I border you guys, you're probably going to attack me. I should probably have it so that for right now... You guys, let's see. You can get to... Just stay next to each other. Get replenishment. Keep pushing forward. Um, other than that, these guys over here, you're still just trying to get more troops. They're right next to us. I have my Waz on going. Let's see. I feel like I should just have you just, just sit here for right now. Sit here for the one more turn. I'm going to have you just stay in ambush dance. And if they try and attack you, then we have the other army and the garrison in here. That's, that's not bad. Okay, they are attacking us here. I only lose a couple units that I'm fine with losing. So I will take both these armies out with this auto-resolve. And then I'm going to grab uh, the replenishment as we are. We need every every able-bodied orc we can get around here. As I'm actually drawing a lot of their attention to Aircrund, which I kind of appreciate. It makes it so it's a bit easier to slowly but surely kind of whittle down their militaries. And then when these guys can keep pushing again, they'll be able to do so with a vengeance. Ambush foiled. So I was over here. Yep, they ran. But that does mean, so at the moment... So let's just have you guys keep making your way over here. So yeah, Grimgore, just stay there for right now. We just need to, to uh, block that one pass. Um, over here, yep, sack and occupy it. I'm going to have you be the one, yeah, again, probably going towards uh, Ungrim to deal with him. Because at the moment, ambush foiled. Yeah, those over here with you guys. But you've been able to hold uh, this army for right now. Essentially is pretty much good to go. I'll have to slowly but surely try and get more Black Orcs, or at least for right now. Uh, what we're going to do is I'm going to try and have you start getting some of your uh, Doom Divers. So you try and go now get more Doom Divers here. So let's do that. Get rid of uh, one of these guys. And then just get more Doom Divers in this area. So you can keep grabbing that. And I think one of my heroes was now finally recovered. Uh, I thought it said one of them was recovered. Yeah, ready for duty. Yeah, they're there. So yeah, if I just bring you over here now, 
I'll just keep staying over here and just keep ambushing. Especially with the, some of you guys coming back now, uh, it'll be a lot easier to try and hold this area. Grimgor, you're just going to keep chilling around here, honestly. Uh, yeah, yeah, we'll just be kind of more in the main pass. It's about the same amount of percentages. Yeah, just go right there. Then we need to have Oglock and everybody. So, you guys... Oh, my God. Why do you have to be such assholes about this? Uh, let's do this instead. Oh, I can't actually do that. I was gonna say, if you guys could jump down that way. I need to get to this fucking city. The walls are making their way forward. Oh, also, you guys did that stupid thing again where my wall was taking attrition even though it shouldn't have been taking attrition. Uh, yeah, it was doing that for both of you, wasn't it? Yeah, okay. So, we're gonna keep making our way forward. Well, actually, I might be able to hit this army. So, let me get... Right here. Oh, Glock. Let's have you try and see if you can attack this army. You can't, but can as heck attack that army. No, neither of you can attack them. Okay, so just stay in raiding stance. There's so many of you assholes around here. Because we just need to hit this one city. That's what I need to do. I just need to hit that one city, and then kill this army and take this other city here, and then you guys are finally dead. Still don't think you guys should be just chasing me through the mountains like they, you guys have been. These guys just won't fucking stop. At least again, I don't lose any units I care about. So, that's fine. Take that. Take the replenishment. They really just want to focus down that one damn area. Also, I decided to try and get Ratnik over in the Desolation of Drakenmore to try and see if he can slow down on Grim. I don't know. It's a, it's worth a shot. At least he didn't move closer. So, that means it's okay. So, we'll be able to try and do something around there. Uh, back over here. So, let's see again. For right now. You guys are not making your way over here. Actually, I think I'm going to go on the offensive again with Grimgore now. So let's start raiding. Start making our way towards the Fortress of Varag. All these other heroes now are making their way back over. So we'll start trying to have them follow around on Gr uh, Grimgore. I just need to make sure he takes that land back so we can actually get the uh, rate of the bonus out of that. Um, let's have you keep making your way up to the Demon Stump. Start raiding that area. And then Ratnik, eventually I will want you to actually get your troops back, your spiders back. But for right now, Mountain Gunabad. Mountain Gunabad. We need to hit you guys here. Take this area. Burn it down. Another 25k there. Hopefully my economy will start trying to improve naturally now soon with me taking so much of Cathay. So I'm hoping that eventually we won't be making so much of a negative right now because of that. But as I push forward a little bit, kind of make your way out of here. Oh, no, I'll try you make your way out of... Oh, not you. It's Azag needs to be the one to get out of the city. So yeah, Azag get out. Raid the region. I'll glock it closer to him again. Uh, ban in this region. Now we just need to get back over here. So we're going to ignore this area. I hate that you guys are co colonizing that crap, but there's not much I can do about that. But we need to finish off Ungrim. Ungrim has to die. Over here, this army, pretty much good for it to go. Uh, we just need to try and have you now get more of your Doom Divers to kind of finish this army off again. So you will need at least three turns, and I think that's going to be good enough. We'll get more of you guys later, but I think that'll be good for you guys. Then back over to Cathay now again. I am able to continue pushing into more of these lands. So we can have it so you guys just have you take this, push in, sacking it for you. Yeah, 25k. Yeah, sack that for the 25k. And then take it for ourselves. So occupy it. And then this region we do want to continue controlling. So build that up there. Get the defenses built up. And then you guys will make your turn way down next turn. And this is the weird bit about right now. So I feel like I'm going to technically ignore this region. I'll take this stuff. But I want to ignore this spot because I don't want you guys pushing back in here. If I'm able to push back with uh, Grimgore more, I think we can take that land. Uh, back over here now. Uh, I was able to reach this area and sack it last turn, but I was able to occupy it, so just take it this turn. So, make your way into Shambletown. Then we can have it so Gorbuzz here. Kind of push forward a little bit here. Keep building these areas up. Back over here now. I've been waiting for you guys to replenish a little bit more. And I think... Do we have enough movement? Because I want to hit you. Lure everybody else out and slaughter this army. But, I don't think we have enough movement to hit you guys. No, we do. Ooh. So let's get you to go right there. And then what I want to do is I'm going to command you. Hell yeah! 
So I'm just taking the auto resolve here. They're not going to run. It's low casualties already. And if I fought the battle, I might not guarantee they all actually die. So we'll do this to guarantee that every single one of these guys is actually dead. And they're not going to be able to try and run away. If it will go through. There we go. That was a little weird. Um, definitely grabbed the replenishment there. And now we'll be able to have it so you guys can just hopefully hit the city. Sack it. I'm, I definitely don't have enough movement to occupy it this turn. So just go into raiding stance. And then I will be taking this settlement next turn. But that is a pretty good hit to their military. And now we'll be able to continue just walking on into these areas. Ah, uh, thank you, Ungrim. Good job, Ratnik. You lured him into a false sense of security that he could beat you. So, you can take him out. Um, once I'm not recruiting uh, everything globally right now, I'll be starting to try and get you your army back again, essentially. That's what we're waiting for right now. Um, so, at the moment right now, I'm just giving him some basic goblins, because I know he'll actually still benefit from that. But now... You've now been able to defeat Ungrim now as well. Um, Skafag, I'm going to bring you in here again. Just take the demon stump. So, claim this area here. Sack that. And then occupy it again. Come on. There we go. There we go. And now we've been able to finally fully reclaim these areas back here. So, that's awesome. Let's have you again build that back up. I'm still wondering if I ever want to actually properly go about and like, kill these guys off or not. Because I've been ignoring these uh, Chaos Dwarves for a while now. They've actually helped me out a lot, honestly. And I kind of find that hilarious. Uh, Grimgore here. And if you hit the Fortress of Rag, you can easily hit that. This is not worth sacking, so just occupy it. And then what we'll do is just yeah, get the defenses built up around there. Uh, get more raid and stuff. And then more growth for right now. And we'll now bring these guys over. So we might be able to try and ambush more stuff again soon. So right there, there, and there. I honestly could technically kind of bring these guys over this way, but I really do feel like we should just keep focusing our attention on to get there with you guys. Um, Armor of Gork. Ooh, nice. Uh, but yeah, let's move you guys out. I can't hit this area just right now, so keep making our way over this way. Uh, you might be able to. Oh, no, you don't have enough movement. So, yeah. Keep making my way over here, guys. Keep raiding what you can. So you keep doing that. Uh, I'll have it so there for right now. Yeah, you guys will be going for Noble Gorge first. So go over here. And right here. You'll Noble Gorge, then the Haunted Forest. Then we'll keep pushing down into this area. I think I might have these two... I, I kind of want you to go to the west, but I think I should push you to the east. Put all of the attention into the forces of... Yeah, I'm gonna ignore your no fucking snake. caravan. Um, let's push on in here now and actually take this region. So push in here again damage that matters really and then occupy it Shang Yang is now under my control um I don't want those because I want to be able to get the defenses I'll get the stuff later for right but for right now I'm gonna demolish that actually and then what we'll do is so I kind of want to ignore that spot for right now because again I want to make sure so that these guys don't join on in just yet I want to focus on her brother first so we'll focus on kind of pushing over to the east a bit more first so we'll kind of go down here a little bit you guys keep making your way down next turn damn it can you guys stop wounding them please please stop I don't like when you wound those units of mine I need them I need them for my wars let's see so you're moving back up this way yeah I'm gonna need more armies around here I I need, I need to finish you guys off. Otherwise, I can just have it so I get you guys over this way. Like, I'm slowly but surely making my way over here with you two. So, I think I might wait until you guys can go to Ungrim and deal with him. Because as long as they're not pushing up here, that's fine. I, I think what we should do is I do need to bring over um, a Skafag here. And I'm going to bring you over this way to kind of try and deal with this army. So, make your way through there. Keep trying to go over that way. Um, Grimgore... I don't have enough movement to hit that damn city. I want to. Let's just get pushed forward. Let's go into raiding stance. Let's just make sure we're far enough away from the city. And we should be fine to push on in there next turn, I think. Uh, back over here now. I can now have it so we're actually going to hit scrap towers. So occupy that. Let's see. So 9k for sack. Yeah, we'll take that sack. And then I'll actually have you be the one that occupies it. Since you got pushed back a little bit further. So just occupy that. You can just stay in raiding stance. And then we'll start building this area up. So build that up. 
I can now hit uh, Nobly Gorge here as well. So hit this. And then this one, 10k, take that. And then I'll have you guys be the ones to occupy it as well. Occupy that. And then start repairing. And then I'll have it so the next turn we'll make our way down, hit the Haunted Forest. And there's only four more regions down here that I specifically want to control. Um, back up here now. Again, I'm going to ignore this area. Let's have it so we're going to make our way over to Taizu. So go over here. Being in rain stance. You also kind of want to make your way over this way as well. Just make sure you're next to each other. Keep going that way. Thoga, you guys finally can do something. And I would say what we're going to do here... Because let's see. So, I mean, you need one more turn. Damn it. Although, like, slowly but surely, if I held this long enough, I'm actually getting this to a point where I might be able to just recruit Black Orcs. Let's see, underway interception. I think I'll take this. Decent damage uh, for another army of you guys. I think this is the one I was actually kind of chasing. So, that army should now be out of the way. We should now be able to push past them and make my way over to Howling Rock to properly finish off Karak Kadron. Because I just want them to die. They're way too stubborn about being more, far more aggressive against the player and not their own self-fucking preservation. I, that's, like, one thing I really don't like about Warhammer. Like, look at this. They're still chasing my ass! Why? Do you give a shit so much that you're gonna chase me through the mountains to try and get rid of these orcs? Why the fuck would you do that? They've been chasing me all the way from here. Why? Go defend your own shit. Stop chasing me. Yes, I know I'm the player, and if you don't uh, pressure me, I'm going to grow strong. But also, think about yourselves and your own self-preservation, please, because this is just so unfucking realistic. Um, let's see, so Grimgore here, I'm going to have you... Let's see, you guys do have walls here, you're almost about to get the garrison stuff built up there. I'm going to have, so let's have you reclaim Ash Ridge Mountains. Get the army off. This one will sack, occupy it. I am sorry. I can start noticing that my income is starting to increase a little bit every time I take more lands, which I appreciate because we just need more cash. So yeah, you guys are good there. I think Grimgore honestly might be good to push it down here himself a little bit, although eh, I don't like you being right there. So I, I might actually bring these guys over. Yeah, just kind of like clear things up. I, I needed to make my way over at least to Pig Barter anyways. So we'll keep making my way over this way. And have it so that you can kind of help out Grimgore a little bit. These armies over here, I think, will be enough to keep pushing into the into Cathay here. So, keep making my way over around here. And then back over... I should now be able to hit Taizu at this point, I think. Is that barely? Barely can't hit it. Oh, my God. Well, uh, get on in here and start raiding, guys. Yep, and of course you guys are going to be pushing on in here. Yeah, that's why I'm going to be bringing those other armies over to try and help out, because you're going to take that. Um, you're pushing back up to the Maw Gate. Okay, so I have to see where that is again. So that should be north. Yeah, that's north of some of my guys. This is why I feel like I need to put more of my pressure onto just Cathay. Because they might occasionally do shit like this. Just take one random little city, and then I have to backtrack and try and reclaim that. Which just really slows things down if you guys are able to do that. Yeah, Darkhold, I knew you guys were making your way over here. I was just not able to get anybody over there in time. That's okay. The Rag has been lost. Mongate has been lost. Yeah, so that's over here. I yeah, I knew this little spot was going to be an issue. Okay, we'll keep trying to build this stuff up. I just need to focus on taking this stuff. They have, like, nothing down here, so maybe I'll split you guys up to, like, sp speed this up. Because at the moment right now, so you guys go here, take that, and then, yep, sack it. It's got quite a bit of money in it. And then this area, I think I might want to just burn. Are you not seriously able to take it? God damn it. Just take it next turn. I, I want to try and have you guys start kind of sp spreading out a little bit to kind of speed up this conquest. Same thing with you guys here. So I'll have you push on in and take Pig Barter. So you can take this, um, sack that area, and then occupy it. And then we'll have it so that we'll uh, have it so the other army goes down south right now and tries to also kind of go down this way. So keep making your way over here. Like the Axe Tribe is dead. You guys at least now can hit Taizu. So take this area here. 
I only really need you guys grouped up together whenever I know that there's going to be an actual proper big fight. Otherwise, for the most part, I can kind of probably split you guys up. Which I think I might try and do that back here. It could lead to some issues, but I think for the most part, they've kind of spread out their armies enough. So I'll start spreading out. So many of you kind of make your way over here. Really just try and hammer home and hit these areas faster, if possible, to do more damage to them. Uh, back over here. They finally stopped chasing me. Fucking finally. Uh, I keep making my way up to Highland Rock. As you guys should be able to get there in, like, what, two turns? Yeah, two turns. You're able to finish that off. Grimgore down here. Let's see. I'm going to have you go right here. I'm going to have you ambush. And all my guys are dead. <laughs> God damn it. They keep wounding my fucking heroes. And, of course, you guys just walked right past me. Probably noticed Grimgore. He had a pretty low chance to ambush. They at least only sacked it. So I'm probably going to kill that army off and then turn back around uh, and go for Varag after that. I would say for right now. I, I am going to have it so that Grimgore, I'm going to leave. I'm not going to send those other armies over here. I really do want them to focus primarily on Cathay. So the Doom Divers that are in Pig Barter right now, they'll keep going back over to the east. Just need to trick the Dragon Island stuff first, too. Because once we have all of that, then we'll be able to... Yeah, they, they put in my ambush. That's kind of what I thought. Okay. So yeah, Grimgore here. God, they have so many armies around here. No, nah, let's just take the, the over rag back for right now. So let's reclaim this. Just occupy it. Because there's a lot of armies over there. Uh, try and build up the defenses around here. Although I'm losing a lot of money right now. Oh, I just need to see how you're running down there. Why don't you try and go back to Darkhold. So take Darkhold back. Go for that. Occupy it again. And then let's see. So for right now... Oh my god, they're still fucking chasing me! Oh, it's so fucking unrealistic! Why are you chasing me to the ends of the earth? <sighs> yeah, this is... Okay. Let's keep pushing up. We're about to finish off you guys. So next turn, I'll be able to finish off Karakadron. I also probably do need to get rid of this army for a time, because it's increasing my upkeep quite a bit. Uh, back over here, again, we're going to start trying to split you guys up. And hopefully this doesn't do... Uh, at least while you guys have Waz going on... This is probably fine. While you guys don't have Waz, that's where I probably need to be a bit more careful and making sure that you're actually with your buddies. So you'll be going back over there. I'm going to have you go down towards... Um, let's say... Yeah, uh, so you can make your way over there. You're trying to have you take the Haunted Forest here. Now you actually have enough movement, so occupy this region. And then uh, get rid of that. Do keep that. Then, this army can at least hit Stone Shattered Bay this turn. So you can expand in here. Easily hit that. Sack it. Push on in again. Occupy it. You do not have enough movement to occupy it. God damn it. Okay. Well, you keep making your way down here. Uh, this army here, I probably should at least have you maybe hit Ruin's End. Nah. I'm going to have you kind of also push over this way too. We'll ignore that place for right now until we turn fully back around. Although I could have you actually, you know, you go over this way. You'll start going with Lugan. I'll leave these two to this area. And you're hating the Great Hall of Greece again. You gonna take it? Yep, you are. So he's at least uh, having his own little tiny little war path around here. Basically what I'll probably be doing is the armies that are focusing on taking the islands. Um, I'll have them probably be the ones that will make their way back up and around to try and deal with him once they're done. Um, lug in here and that other one. Uh, this is the area that's recruiting more shit anyways. So I'll take the three kills and the like 20k. <laughs> Fuck it. Uh, another one. Yeah, I'll take that one too. Get the replenishment this time I would say. You guys are just so dead set on anything. I honestly, you guys might never get the fuck out of here. Because at the moment, I've just been having to endlessly kill you as you keep trying to take my shit. I'm just trying to recruit more. Like, sure, okay. Hey, you, you keep giving me tons. I, guess I just made, like, what, 30, 40k from that? <laughs> from just fighting around there? Gladly. So that'll save me over uh, for at least one more turn. Like, honestly, I want those guys to be able to eventually go back to put... Holy shit, look at this! I didn't realize how many armies they have around you just trying to kill this one spot. God, the AI in Total War Warhammer is way too aggressive against the player. 
Like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> like, seriously. Uh, you keep getting more Doom Divers. And then, uh, you, I'm gonna have get more Black Orcs. So, disband some, uh, of you guys. And then give me some more Black Orcs! Slowly but surely, I'll get an army of just Black Orcs! Let's see if you guys kind of merge together. That way I can get another one. There you go. Okay, guys. Just keep distracting them over there. It's fucking beautiful. Um, oh, you're sieging me. Let's see. Either one that's sieging, I need to make sure I'm hitting the right one. Yeah, you are the one that's sieging. Okay, yeah, lightning strike. Uh, fuck off. Get out of here. Give me that replenishment. And then Grimgor. Let's see, you pushed them back. Are they now... They're not isolated away. Let's see, I hit you. Lightning strike. I'd lose one of my black orcs. Let's withdraw from that. I'm just gonna have Grimgor make his way back up this way. He's overextending right now, so just go into raiding stance. Pull back. We at least took out that one army, and now we get to just kind of freely pull away. So, do that. Uh, Thorga, again, take the Stone Shattered Bay. And then I'll have it so occupy that region. You are going to be keep making your way past. Keep going to the lake area. And then what we'll be doing right now is Scram, you and uh, Luggin will be the two that are going to start trying to push on in this way. Uh, once you guys are done down here, you'll go up and deal with them, I would say. But now I can finally fucking kill these guys. Hi, guys. Die, finally. Be dead and stop annoying me, Karak Kadron. Please tell me they're dead. Come on, come on, come on. I want to see the notification they're dead. Notification they're dead. Are they seriously not dead? How the hell are you not dead? Oh, you have this army up here. It's just a bunch of miners. Oh my god. Then I'm just gonna throw a bunch of fucking uh, goblins at you. There, you're dead. There we go. And now dead. There we go. Finally. And they'll just respawn later. But, uh, Rachnik, I'm gonna have you honestly get rid of this army for right now or at least reduce it because like i want to get you your actual army back we have to hold off on that all glock i'm gonna probably have to have you guys like if they're still chasing me i'm just gonna murder them all because why are you endlessly chasing me like this but i do think i'm gonna be done for today probably at this point uh because now well actually maybe i can do a little bit more i can have you guys properly take take this area expand a little bit more because I know we're getting really close to finishing this campaign. I We're definitely finishing this before episode 20. Um, given how things have been going right now. Like, what? The start of this video, uh, you had, like, what, 50 regions? You now have 33. I've taken a lot of land from the western provinces. And so far, right now, we're still pushing on into you guys. Um, once we take this, and I just push all of you into this area, it will not take that much longer to finish you guys off, I would say. And so, let's see, this is episode 16. I can see this by 20. Yeah, at least by 20. Because things have been going well, and basically, I just want to at least fight one of the endgame scenarios with Grimgore as like a final finale. I think that would kind of be fun. Um, and it's just right now, the victory conditions, Yeah, we technically just need a couple more regions, that's all I need. Uh, and it's just like, hey, once we take two more, because I lost the Greases, called Great Hall of Greases. We're just so close to that, but I'm going to be done for now, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. If you guys did, let me know down in the comments down below. Love hearing what you guys have to say about this campaign and your thoughts type on it in general. This is Rampan, and I'll see you guys next time.